Welcome back, YouTube. Welcome back to the Drama Experience. It's your boy Jim. And I'm Tay. And we're back with another video. So as you can see, we're in the car, ready to head out and start our day. So today is going to consist of what day? So we decided to have a date night because although it seems like we go out a lot, we haven't just went out, just me and him. Yeah. Italy doesn't count. That was not a date. That was my birthday. So we haven't had a real date since July. It's October. And I feel like we go out all the time. So we took the whole day to have activities. I got my makeup done, we dropped Ryan off with her grandma's there's. Yep. Both grandmothers are watching her today and her auntie. So we're gonna eat brunch, then we're going to mini golf. Then we are doing a little shopping. We got a hotel, we never stay in hotels in New York City, so this is like a mini staycation. And then we also are going to dinner tonight. So stay tuned for our New York City date night staycation. Stay in. Staycation. Staycation. Yes. Ish. <laughs> Catch you guys later. Between the numbers. Oh! All right, Tiger Drame. Oh! God, late! Babe, stop the ball! Yay! Finally! <laughs> We just had a lovely brunch, yo. Brunch was really good. So we went to Sunflower Grain Receipt or Sunflower Cafe in New York City. It's downtown on like 25th Street-ish. Mm -hmm. But um, it was really good. It was amazing. I got two entrees because I was really hungry. Being a fatty. I got steak and eggs with, um, steak and eggs with they're called, I can't, I can't think It don't matter. Either. They were good though. With potatoes. <laughs> and then I also got the French toast. And it was good. I ate both. I kept it simple and got chicken and waffles. But she was eating my food. Her French toast was so good. good. Oh, Slamming. We did have to wait because they don't take reservations, but it was only 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. Service was amazing. Yeah, service was amazing. It was good. Um, it was really nice. And it's not necessarily like a place where you really dress up and go. I was dressed up because I just dressed be dressed up, up. Dressed down. But you can be dressed down. Yeah. You can just stop there and eat and then go. You can get, get a croissant for takeout. Mm -hmm. um, they had a lot of options there. Yeah. So I think that overall I would highly recommend. You went to Swingers Mini Golf. I loved it. It was dope. I want to go back. Swingers Mini Golf is really, really fun. Yeah. They had like nine different golf courses that we went mm -hmm. on and we all got six tries to get them in. Who won? I, I'm gonna say you, but I don't know. We, 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 I won. I wish you could have recorded the whole thing. I, I think I would. I, one of them was really tough. Number it was a, it was a it was a course. It was like number four. It was tough. She couldn't get it. I got it though. I got it once, but that thing is hard. Yeah, it, it was tough. It was it's tough. like one thing when you get it once, you don't try it again. Yeah, you, you just you just take the W and keep. Yeah, doing I got it. like a hole in one with that one. It was. It was yeah, dope. that one was hard. The place was really nice. So you buy, you pay for your ticket in advance. You get yeah. a time slot. Yeah. They put you in a group and you go through the different courses. Um, they have food. They have beverages. They have everything. Everything so yeah. like you can still hang out there if you want chit chat. We have other things to do, so we just left. Yeah, we have to go. We have to go, but uh, we did have a wonderful time. I definitely will go back. We that was my should... first time doing mini golf. Were right? I never did that before. Did I ever do? I don't think I ever did mini golf either. Hmm. No. But yeah, I'll go back. But now uh, we gotta stop at Saks because one, Soraya doesn't have a. Uh, a picture day outfit. Picture day outfit and picture day is Monday and I ordered something and it, I paid for it to be here by tomorrow and it's coming Tuesday. You already know how that goes. Mm -hmm. So we're going to go try to find her an outfit. Um, our winner from our fragrance oh, giveaway yeah. <laughs> has selected her perfume so we're going to go buy that. Congratulations once again Aminata Fofana. Yes, so Aminata um, selected her perfume. We're going to go pick that up and then this guy here, I don't know. It's always something with him. Now he don't, Yo, he don't got his fellas, shoes. Fellas, 
I know y'all on the same type of time I'm on. Sometimes you forget things, you know what I mean? We're last minute. I can't, we can't help it. Oh, we're last minute. Don't put all of them in the group with you. Yeah, they're gonna be in the group with me. Okay. I'm telling you, all right? We're last minute, but we're gonna get it done though. So I gotta probably get something or I might have to go all the way back home to get my shoes. Yes, so we're gonna go to Saks, see what we can get. Hopefully we find something. Hopefully he finds something and then we gotta get to the hotel because I'm gonna do some relaxation before dinner. Yeah. I can't wait. So we staying at the public hotel. So after Saks, we'll sense. go to our hotel and we'll show you what it looks like. Yes, sir. So stay tuned, guys. Stay tuned. I swear, he's always tired. He got the stamina of I don't know what. He's not tired. I'm actually okay. All right. So what do we got here? You got two options. So this is Raya's first option. It's a sweater and a skirt attached, you know, for kids trying to make it more convenient for the parents. And then this is a, it's a cute skirt. Oh, it's nice. It's very nice. So those are the two options we have because unfortunately the outfit that I ordered, is not gonna come till Tuesday, even though I paid for express shipping, AKA I want my money back. So we are in the perfume or well, fragrance department buying the perfume for Aminata, who was the winner of our giveaway. So we're back at Sax picking up her prize. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please do so that you can get in for the next giveaway because we got some good, good stuff coming. So, Aminata won it. Gentle Fluidity Silver. And that's this one right here. I actually smelled a la rose today over here. And if you love floral scents, that one smells really good. Of course, nothing other than the Lilabo. He's so tired. We bought another cologne by Rado. So, Dim is not here. I know I'm oily. It's been a long day, but Dim is not here. So, I just wanted to give you a tour of the room and give you some updates on our room situation here at the public hotel. So, this is our room. We booked the residential suite. So, initially when we first got here, I was a little bit confused because this door was closed and it just was this space and we booked the suite. Um, but then we were informed to open this door and that our key fob opens up the room next door to us. So basically it's a two in one room. Um, so, this is the sink area right here with the mirror. And this is the bathroom space, toilet, and shower. Uh, this is the bed. There's like a little closet in the space here with a safe in the fridge. Bed. And then this is supposed to be my suite with the chair. Um, sink again. Basically a bigger version of the setup in uh, the other room. Um, honestly, I'm not really too pleased with this room setup because for a suite, you would think that it would like not have two beds and be more of like what a open space concept instead of two individual rooms with a door open so i was just a little bit confused about that and also i think the sink being in the by the door like you wash your face and you brush your teeth like right here by the door and um this bathroom like the tub i mean not that i don't think that the light the light goes up any more than this it's like it has this little concept that's pretty dull in here but um the tub doesn't look that great so there are some things that i'm just not wowed by this hotel i think the aesthetics and the vibe is really nice coming in but overall the suite i'm not impressed especially for the price um this hotel is not cheap at all so i was expecting a little bit more and from the pictures that i saw online i was not expecting this i would go complain to get my room switch but i am so tired so the self check-in didn't even work so we had to wait online there was only one person doing manual check-in so we get all the way upstairs and we figure out that the room that we got is a suite but it's technically just a double room so i have one hour to just chill while dim goes home picks up his shoes comes back and then we have dinner so i don't even know if it's worth it right now to complain and get another room request another room because then I'll have to take all of our stuff, move it to that room, cut out the time that I actually have to chill here, and we check out in the morning because this is a one night staycation. So I guess I'm gonna suck it up, but I am gonna tell him that I'm not pleased um, with this because I was definitely 
thinking we were getting something else based on the pictures that we saw on the website. This is not it. Um, and that's all, folks. So I'm just going to chill, probably watch some Netflix or something until it's time for me to start getting ready. Sorry, can I just And Babe has short ribs. I started eating my short ribs already. Just. How is it? Delicioso. Delicioso. <laughs> <laughs> they good. It's good. So, how was dinner? Dinner was amazing, y'all. It was good. What was, the, what was the restaurant name again? Skinos. Skinos, yeah. Skinos was really good. We had a whole bunch of everything. Yeah, the only thing we didn't care for was the oysters and the octopus. And we are like really, really strict critics of oysters and octopus because it's one of our favorite appetizers. Mm -hmm. uh, but the food was really good. The ambiance was nice. Everything. It was really good. So we really enjoyed ourselves at dinner. We now we're back at the hotel. I'm forced to wear the same outfit that I had on from yesterday because. He left, he left his shoes again, but this time, no, no, seriously, let's not, let's, no, let's go back. Mm -hmm. He goes home to get his shoes, right? Mm -hmm. Our car gets a flat tire. He has to park the car, take an Uber downtown. Leaves his cell phone in the Uber. Brand new cell phone, iPhone 14 Pro Max, left it in the Uber. Forgets his iPhone, I, Apple ID password. <laughs> can't find the phone, can't find my iPhone or phone when you don't know the password. He took like an hour to figure that out. I got it though. Got it. And I got it back. We got it back today, right? Now, it's time to go home and he don't have shoes to go home. He only got the shoes that he went out with last night. Ridiculous. I was dressed a little bit and she, you know, she's getting ready to go. Yeah, I got to work today. But, um, overall, we had a great date night, yeah. date day. You know, I think it's just really important. We've been together for a really long time for us to just like take time out for us to really just bond and chill with each other. Yeah. Um, we do spend a lot of time together, of course. We live together, uh, we're at home as a family, but it's very different when you're being intentional about the time that you spend and going on dates. So we, we love dates. Uh, we can't go on as many as we used to before we became parents, but we do try to at least have once a month. Last month was really busy for me, so I really was not feeling date night last yeah. month. But whatever schedule or uh, how many times you would like to do it, I think you and your partner, for those of you in a relationship, should just come up with a schedule and like have meaningful date nights or intentional times with you all. We've been doing it for a long time and it still feels the same. Like It don't feel like, oh my God, you're going on date night again. You know what I mean? It's, I thought date night was all the time. Like all the time and it still feels the same, bro. Wait. Shit is crazy. Crazy. Yeah, so overall, I think our date night was a success. It was a success. It was good. I'm looking forward to another date night vibe like this. You know what I mean? Even though we go on dates on the regular, but this was like more intentional, set up, um, a whole itinerary, and it was um, dope. So thank you guys for tuning in again. We are going to have a lot of giveaways towards the end of the year, so please don't forget to comment, like, and especially subscribe to our channel so you could be able to join these giveaways, man. We'll catch you guys later. Peace.